Assalamu alaikum guys. Hope everybody will be fine. Today in this video lecture I will guide you for size of beam and size of steel rods for the span of 20 feet. If the span between two columns is 20 feet, so what should be the size of beam and its steel rod size and its numbers? Because this question is asked by a student that sir what is the size of beam and steel rods size or dia for 20 feet span? Of course, this is very important. Before starting the video, I will tell you what I am telling you in this video. This is for domestic building, not for commercial building. If you want to construct your house and you need to construct ground floor plus first floor, so it's okay. You can, uh, someone can give you the design, normal design because uh, uh, size of beam, column, foundation, everything is depend on the structure load. If you want to increase the story, ground floor, first floor, second floor. So in that case, you need to hire the structural engineer because no one can tell you that what should be the size of beam, uh, column, etc. for different stories, okay? Because all these things is, de is depend on the structure load. So therefore, I recommend you guys, you should hire the structural engineer if you go more than two story, okay? So you need a structural drawing. So if you don't have the structural drawing and you need to uh, construct your house ground floor plus first floor so in that case what should be the size of beam and size of steel rod if the span is 20 feet guys you can see these two are columns this is column and this is other column now the span between these two columns is 20 feet okay and this is beam so what should be the size of this beam? So this is the topic, okay? Guys, the size of the beam should not be less than first size of beam. From 18 to 20 feet for domestic building, the size of the beam should not be less than 12 inch by 14 inch. So this is size. That's why because guys, in this case, this is the section for beam. So the depth should be 14 inches and the width should be 12 inches. Okay, to the span of 20 feet, okay? from 18 to 20 feet. So less than 18 feet, so we will change the size and also steel rods. So in this case, guys, the size is this one and now steel reinforcement details. Okay, so use six steel rods. Four steel rods at the bottom. and two at the top. Got it? So these four steel rods dia should not be less than 16 mm. And the top steel rods dia should not be less than 12 mm. Got it? So use six numbers and total six numbers four steel dia 16 mm which we are placing at the bottom and two steel rods two steel size should be 12 mm. 12 mm bar should be provided at the top and compression zone and 4 steel rod should be provided at the bottom place in this case. Okay. But I will tell you one thing more. So if you want to provide on the top of first floor, second floor. Okay. So in the case of three story. So guys remember that we will use two more steel rods, side rods, at, uh, at dia should also 
not be less than 12 mm in the case of three story so for two story you can use four steel rods at the bottom two at the top top dia 12 mm bottom diameters dia should be 16 mm so in that case guys you can provide here extra rods like this let me when you are using steel rods like this so in the junction here you will provide extra steel rods like this on the top of this to the distance of l by 4 this is l by 4 distance same here on the top two or three steel rods we will provide extra which length should not be less than l by 4 l by 4 same like this one okay so this is for the span of 20 feet so these are its diameters size of a uh, uh, size of beam 12 by 14 inches for domestic building not for commercial building otherwise we will use uh, more steel uh, steel reinforcement in the case of commercial building so guys concrete cover here the concrete cover concrete cover should be 40 mm concrete cover or you can say 1.5 inches on each side on four side we will provide 1.5 inch concrete cover so in that case guys the lead uh, the stirrups as you can see this is the long section okay so these are stirrups so the stirrups to the distance of l by 4 as i told you before like this so it should not be less than four inches okay center to center so after l by four it should be not more than six inches four inches to the distance of l by four and six inches to the distance of after l by four so this is stirrups details and the die of stirrup should not be less than eight mm this is dia for stirrup stirrups dia should be eight mm with the spacing of 4 inches and 6 inches center to center got it so here guys the hooks these hooks should be bent with 135 degree okay and the length should be not less than 3 inches these hooks so guys this is the design of uh, if you don't have the structural drawing so you can uh, follow these rules regulation and die of steel rod its size etc hope this video can help you thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye